guys, it's Ray Cecina, I do. How's it going? So today, guys, we are going to be making the finest hogs made by the beer. So, guys, let's get on with the ingredients, and then we're going to get making it. Alright guys, so we've got the ingredients, the first thing we need guys is the cream soda. So what we're going to do is, we have got a 2 litre bottle, so we are going to have to guess a litre. So, have we got a messenger jug? Nope. Nope, let's have a look at this. It's about a litre, right? Nope. No, that's 2 litres. Just, just do guesswork. It's going to be half for that anyway, so we're just going to have to guess it. Um, but you need a litre of cream soda. So all we have to do is just pour it in the saucepan. I guess you could use two litres because obviously um, you would just need a lot more for the servings for it. But that is near enough about a litre, I guess. What do you reckon? I reckon that should be enough. We don't want to go and kill yeah. it. That will be enough of cream soda, guys. So we plonk the cream soda there, and then we are going to wait for that to boil. Boil. While we're waiting for that to boil, guys, we're going to get on with the other ingredients and put them in this saucepan. So let's get on with them. All right, guys. So we have got some brown sugar. So what we need is two to three tablespoons of brown sugar. So what we have to do is just plonk one. That's a teaspoon, by the way. So you have to do double the amount. Okay, so it's one, two, one more, three. Okay, so that's the sugar out of the way. Get into the blur, and we need to add another two to three tablespoons of butter as well. So it would have been better if I had a knife, but it should be fine. Way more than that. Alright, we've got enough now, guys. Alright guys, so that's the butter out of the way, so we're just going to fold the butter up and we're going to put that back into the fridge. So when we do that, we're just going to grab another spoonful of sugar and then we're just going to mix it. Alright guys, so we've just put the other spoonful of sugar in over the butter. So all we need to do now guys is just mix it and then we need to dump it into the cream soda when that's boiled. And it is nearly boiling now. But the hob's not on, babe. Yes, it is. Only one is. Sorry.
actually wait for the butter to melt into the sugar. So we just need to keep stirring. Alright guys, so obviously we've just got some butter splattered over us. Um, so once this is done guys, we are going to pour it into the cream soda. Alright guys, so this is literally done. All we have to do now is dump it into the cream soda. So let's get going. So what we're doing now is making sure every last bit of the butter and the sugar is in the cream soda. That is literally all we have to do now guys. So once that's done guys. Alright guys, so once that's done, all we need to do now guys is we need to put some cream in it and then the last ingredients and then we have to stir it and then wait for them to melt inside of the cream soda and then guys obviously we will have our butter beer so let's get going all right guys so we've literally we've got the cream and the last ingredients guys are wafers originals so we need four to five ways wafers originals and then guys the butter beer done so let's get on with making the butter beer so we're just literally adding the cream into the soda now, so let's carry on. making sure every last bit of the cream is in to the soda. You don't have to have the last bit of the cream into the soda but it's better if you do and then all you have to do is just quickly stir the cream into the soda. Once that's done guys, all we need to do now is add five wafer originals. Just making sure every last bit of the cream is in to the soda. You don't have to wrap the last bit of the cream into the soda, but it's better if you do. And then all you have to do is just quickly stir the cream into the soda. Once that's done guys, all we need to do now is add five wafer originals. Turn the hob down. I was going to say check this, don't I? It'll do something over you don't want in.
We're literally just stirring it now until the wa uh, original wavers are melted. So waver original, sorry guys. So we are just stirring it until they are melted. Once they are melted, it is literally ready to serve. Um, well, as long as it's really boiling hot, then it's ready to serve. Uh, so all we have to do is just keep stirring it until they obviously um, melt into the cream soda, sugar, burr, and whatever else is in here, cream and stuff. Um, so once, so as you can see, obviously the Waver Originals are still hard. Um, and they just need to melt inside uh, the cream soda. Once they have done, obviously it turns into butter beer. And also with uh, butter beer, guys, um, it is a lot nicer when it's served hot. So that's why we're doing it this way. Guys, right, so literally. It is done now guys, all the way the original guys had melted, so all we have to do is stir for literally another 10 seconds or something like that. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Oh yeah. So guys, it is done, so let's get it into the cups and uh, have a nice drink. Alright guys, so we've literally just poured the butter beer into the cup guys, um, as you can see. So all we need to do now guys, is literally taste it, and hopefully this is fantastic. Mmm, this is actually fantastic, oh! Mmm, so don't take my word for it guys. Let's get a second opinion. I'm sure about this. It's really sweet. It's really nice. It's nice. <laughs> it's like really hot, I've just burnt my tongue. Alright guys, so that is how you make Hogsmeade's finest butter beer. But guess what guys, guess what, because I made it, and obviously it, it tastes fantastic, it should be called the Razor C92 finest butter beer. So uh, if you think that guys, comment in the comments below, comment in the comments below guys, what you think of this video, what do you think of us making the Hogsmeade butter beer, how do you think that it went and everything like that guys just comment in the comments below what you want to see on the next video anyway guys we're going now hope you really enjoyed this video we enjoyed making it for you guys we really really enjoyed making it for you guys and uh, we love making all these videos for you and uh, we wouldn't be here if we weren't having fun were we guys we're having so much fun anyway guys so guess what we're gonna have to go now so you know what to do guys smack that like button and subscribe to wolf up and we'll see you in my next video.